way, the ancient Chinese philosophy helps to create harmony and peace within the space, Feng means wind and Shui refers to water. Together they both represent the movement of Qi that is energy which shows to have a great influence on human behavior and surroundings. Size, shape and surroundings influence the quality of Qi. The entrance door of our house is also known as mouth of Qi or heart of home where good or bad Qi enters. This could either nourish or deprive our home and inhabitants. The quality of energy outside the house determines the quality of energy inside the house, so, to feng shui your entrance door, one should keep these key factors in mind. Check for any crack or peeling paints outside your house, use your favorite colors for paint. There should be no trash cans, dirt, debris at entrance. It should be clean. The main door should be the grandest and solid with no scratches. This supports to give strength to the family and symbolizes unity. Glass doors, windows and too many glass partitions should be strictly avoided as this doesn't provides any sort of protection resulting in damaged parts or even fragile family. Suggested that arched shaped doors, big and wide doors, fancy door with multiple openings or a door within a door are not so good options. The house may lose fortune if having a double door use only one side. This promotes balance. Some people decide the color of entrance and interior doors based on the direction the house is facing, using the color Bagua map. For instance, a southwest facing house with pink door harmonizes love and relationships. Certain entries emit beam of Sha Chi, Bad Chi. Avoid sharp corners, weathered trees that obstruct flow of good energy, D or Y junction house that carry negative Qi from roads and towers carrying negative charge for current flow. There are three types of front door layout. When the front door is in middle it is called as Phoenix door. When it is in left of the house it is called as Green Dragon door and finally the right one is called White Tiger door. In all kinds of layout. The house must have a small pond or garden in order to attract good chi. Entryways directly facing washrooms, kitchen or backyard are also the examples of bad feng shui. The door shouldn't be directly in front of the road. As a solution to it, lush, live plants in symmetry around the door block the negative chi and convert it into positive chi. Main door should not face any staircase directly. This does not allow good chi to accumulate and distribute throughout the house. As a remedy to this and also in general one can use different types of wind chimes. Wind chimes furnish sound healing and should be hanged in east side that is in the direction of wind. Door should always open inward to an open space, wide and pleasing foyer with water pots, beautiful art pictures, showpieces. This ensures flow of vibrant, uplifting energy throughout the house. It is highly encouraged to have a spiritual symbol, flower basket, doormat, light lamps, auspicious plants like bamboo and money plants in symmetry around the entryway. This invites health, wealth and prosperity. The entryway and foyer should be well lit and bright even in the night time. Fountains showcase water flow that helps to gain wealth. One should be cautious of using mirrors and avoid keeping shoe cabinet in entryway or foyer.